I feel more freedom now that I have the iPad. It doesn't work with Iphen. It's iPhone. I think that was uh, Zach Galifianakis. Okay, so this is the quick and dirty. Oh, dirty. I went to Savers because I, I had to go to the Dollar Tree. The do I'm in like, is it a right turn and then a right? Then I'll go there. Yeah. And you have to do a left. So it's the whole thing is not happening. So I decided, let me just schlep it off to Savers, which is a place. Which is a place, like you guys don't know what Savers is, but what is it? Which is a place for me here that always has jewelry always like a ton in the um cases and on the walls yeah, that's the bat lady with the bat bat arm oh, wings these are bat wings right what's going on ha -ha. yeah i got my grandmother's my maternal grandmother's well and paternal too because her line was the breast cancer line i believe it doesn't matter I'm not talking about breast cancer right now, but I'm talking about, I got my grandmother's big thighs, big arms, and my dad's big belly. It's a winning combo. Okay. None of my other, none of the other females in my family have those ar uh, arms or bellies. Like in not, okay. Anyway. So I decided, well, let me just go to Savers. After I go to the Dollar Tree, which I needed to do, I just needed the... I call it the thirty dollar tree because that's always the minimum. The minimum. And they though they though. I walked in. It looked like they'd been robbed. <laughs> Their jewelry. Seriously, it was like one little sparse thing here and one little spark, and it's usually just bang, banged up with shit. Wall, same thing. Like I could just glance from eight feet, ten feet away and go, I see nothing. No reason to go closer. Oh, I think it's there. It's the Dollar Tree. I like them. I think they're cute. Anyways, and when I went into um, the Dollar Tree, I wear my mask kind of anyway, but I didn't for some reason when I went to the Dollar Tree. And like 95% of the people, including the employees, but the employees, it's like, well, hmm, I think they might be half to or something. But I'm looking around. I'm like, oh, shit. <sighs> Anyways, I just prefer to wear it. I'm used to wearing it. Oops, it's whatever. So after that, I put it on. But I just, for a hot minute, I'm like, oh my God, is it mandatory? Because I know it's mandatory in LA. At least it was last week. I don't know if they've lifted it. So no real jewelry. I did get myself a little pretty. It was way overpriced, guys. It was $15. And I asked the gal, because I wanted to chitty chat and find out what the scoop de oop is and why it's so barren. And she said the gal that does the jewelry has been off for three or four days. So that's why. And I was almost like my fantasy was to get up and go there. I don't know where to look. I'm just looking. This is where I have to look. You don't understand. It's flipped. Okay, never mind. So I was going to like fantasy was get up and get over there by 11 when they open. Because savers, our savers, if you don't get there when they open or close to it, A, you're not going to get a jewelry jar. Which isn't really honestly, weirdly not my thing there because their jewelry jars are shitty but they have good jewelry in the display and on the walls and a how glad i didn't fucking do that i'm glad i didn't get up earlier haul my ass over there just to find it like barren a barren wasteland so what i did do is i got well i got this bracelet it's so pretty though i don't know if you can tell and it's not heavy or anything it's but it's just a sparkly. And you know how many hundreds, literally hundreds and hundreds of rhinestone bracelets I've had? This one, they're like a champagne, a champagne yeah, color. But they were just like diamonds in there. They were just like, wah, 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 wah. So her and I both went over it like, she's a young girl. And she's like, you could go to Forever 21. I'm like, you could, but yeah. You know. Would ya? No, I like Forever 21 clothes, actually. Every time I pick out something for myself or I love something, it's like, ah, Forever 21. <sighs> forever 61, which I'll be. Right? It's beautiful. It's a little big. I think it's a seven and a half. -y. It's got to be, because look. Look. And look. Bad. Okay. So, thought I'd do old school. Because, like, 
up until like a year and a half, two years ago, I'd do hauls, purses, hard goods, whatever videos. If you want to go way back in the archives, I'm not saying they're exciting, but I'm just saying that's what I did. Okay. Until the COVID hit. I'll just show you the clothes. I know it's not exciting, but these are clothes for me. I don't shop to sell unless I see some, like, that Ed Hardy. I always go back to that, that fucking cool ass Ed Hardy jacket that I got and sold for a couple hundo. I paid 20 or 25 It wasn't, like, a $5 jacket. Uh, Kathmandu imports. I love an import. I love an India situational. It's a topial with the bagadagal feet. I haven't tried it on. What I don't love on me ever, I like this spaghetti. I'm not a big even cappy. I don't like the cappy. But I just said today, I don't even know if the dressing rooms are open. I wouldn't have used them. But I was just like, oh, fuck it. They're five, six dollars each. What evs? And this one was one where it was like, if I don't feel cute in it, then I'll just wear it as a, like a nighty gown. But I did like the bottom of this one as well. Oh. <sighs> Because it does, you can't even see. Look, can you see what it does? It does an uneven thing. It's not a, it's not a what you call it. It's not a mullet. And it's not that other one, but it's yet something else. And then this top, I need to dress this, by the way. Love this top. Always going to get a thing like this. Just, that's just me. That's me in a top right there. It's fatty. And then yellow, she's like, I mean, mm. I'm okay in yellow. I'm not like whatever, but this is cute. And so like, oh yeah, there's a hole. Well, that's fantastic. I'll wear it though. Cause I'm just that, I'm that ghetto bitch. I will wear that. I won't even sew it. I don't care. It's like tattered. Shadooby. It's cute. It's springy. And then I saw this adorable. So I'm never, I never not look at the purse. I can't help it. Savers has good purses. They usually get a lot of Betsy. This is not Betsy. I love this so much. What is happening? Taunt Claus. And it reminds me of... This is actually leather. Um, it reminds me... The handles are leather. Nordic House of Designs. Nordic? I don't give a shit. -ick. Oh, and then look at this. Somebody put their little adorbs charm on there, right? Oh, the charm says something. I'll take it off, see what it says. Anyways, there was a gal oh, two, three, four years ago. I don't know how long ago. Probably three or four. And she was walking around Savers. She was older like me or ish, right? LK. Lauren Conrad? <laughs> LK. What is happening? I don't know what LK is. It doesn't really matter. It's sweet. It's just a sweet little charm. I'm going to put it right back on because I feel like it came with the purse and it should stay with And this also has, like, I will dead on carry this purse. Dead on. So, because it has these, and I usually have, I have so many purses. I usually have extra purse straps. These are tiny little ones, but whenever, because like my LV, when I used to carry all the speedies, uh, you, they didn't have, you had to hook it onto the handles. Seriously, I'll think. Come on now. It's happening. Anyway, love. So I was in a safer three or four years ago. And I saw this lady flash by. And she had one like this. Only it was, the whole body was leather. And it was Halloween. Halloween. And I just, I, I was like staring. I was like casually like just staring at it. And then I finally just followed her around. And I said, excuse me. Excuse me. Where did you get that? And she told me the whole story, which I don't remember now. She got it online. It was vintage then. Mm, vintage meaning, you know, probably the 80s or 90s. When she bought it. Whenever she bought it. Not in the 80s or 90s, but when she bought it, it was... Okay. And it was some maker, and you better believe I looked online for six months after that. Never found one. Now I don't remember the name. Don't know if it's the same people as this. It's not ringing a bell. But I just... I said, man, if you ever consider selling it, I'm your gal. She said, I love it. I bring it out every Halloween. And I was like, yeah, I'd wear it every day. 
there's that. Okay, last but not least. Now, I've had these. I've sold these, so I know what they are. And this hot piece of ass just happens to be a tagged and nice one. Aha. Uh -huh. Harvey's seatbelt. God, why is it not? Oh, okay, there, that's better. That's not good. That's better. It's looking blue. It's like a Kelly green. It's really quite green. And it was 25 but, right? The last sold, exact same one, last sold was 300 on eBay. Not, not trying to get, but sold. And I figured it's new with tags, clearly never been worn. It's, um, yes, please. I'm in math, please. And I spotted it, it was way down the bottom, like, because they do have copies of the Harveys, but I've had both. I've had the real ones and the fake ones and their wallets and whatever. Yeah, I have I know a thing or two about a thing or two when it comes to purses, only because um, I collect them. I like them. I like them too, too much. I've been very good about not buying, like, you know, when I don't really need it. And yes, again, I would carry this year-round. Okay, so I should go. 12 minutes higher than the town. I'll do a light box video. I'm just gonna get my life. Um, I don't know if this is gonna be a catch and release because watch how it releases right off of my hand. Let's just do a measure, shall we? It's gotta be a seven and a half, that's all. Uh oh oh good the safety chain does come undone i love when that's a thing should be a thing still shouldn't have been 15 there come on i mean i guess for personal that's fine i wasn't buying it to flip it let's cut and resist it and it's just nothing it's not super special but oh my god the bling of it all i don't know if you're getting the full effect but it is a balingi I'm hungry. Okay, I must eat after this. I just have to see for myself. Oh, yeah. Yep. Little tad over. Tad over. Well, I don't know that it would be a tad over. Hold on. I don't really think it'd be a tad over. Nah. If I get it. Well, you'll believe me. Why would I lie to you? Why would I tell you special lies? Special sneaky lies. Seven and a half, I just know my wrist. My wrist is a six inch. So seven, seven and a quarter, and I can, you know, you saw me wearing this. I can I can wear it. About another big speed ring. <laughs> What's happening? And yeah, I only buy her I don't know what you want to call it. This is the plainest Bixby ring I've ever bought. If you want to call that plain, that would be the bitch. But allow it. But yeah, she's got her low end line, lower end, whatever. And her low end line, like the cheapest ring is like 125, but they're just, I don't know. I'm not, again, I don't buy just all Betsy. I buy the pieces that I like from the designer. Eh? Yeah. <sighs> Luckily it's not heavy, so isn't it pretty? I just couldn't. This little girl, I think she's a six and three. Let's take her off and measure. <laughs> you tell I'm stalling. I've got a little, uh, not a competition, but a little thing going with, I don't think she care, Janda. We're gonna do like, let's see if we, you know, what do you call it, like accountability? Because she sells on eBay too. I'm like, let's see if we can, who can, Let's see if we can both just get 10 things listed. How about that? It's not a guy. It's not a big goal, people. I used to do 10 things in one day, every day. No, it's dead on seven inches. So yeah, I think seven inches is me size, sis. I know what I mean. Even though I'm a six. Uh, seven is good. Oh, I think there's auctions tonight. I don't know. I may or may not watch, just depends what I'm feeling like. Oh, did it show you the sold on eBay? 
could, because I have it pulled up on my phone still from, oh god, it takes me a sec, odd second to get the big speed back down my wristy. This is uh, fascinating for you. I apologize. Why do? Oh, fucking balls. Oh my god, it's because I'm in a hurry. I don't like you to have to sit here while I'm doing this bullshit. So I'm not going to make you. Get up. Did I already show? This one came in the bag. Why are they just showing me the pictures? What the fucking balls is with the glare? Mine just doesn't have a bag. Other than that, I don't know what I'll ask for it, but it's just, I'm trying to get more eBay stuff besides jewelry. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, I have a ton of hard goods. I should say, not only besides jewelry, but that's not, I'm not trying to buy more breakables, big heavy breakables. It's so hard to ship them. Uh, I hate doing it. I'm not a fan. I haven't been for a very long time. Okay. Now I'm gonna go. My ring will be here tomorrow, Friday. It's coming from Cala. They're shipping at USPS. I'm gathering that's where the the person works because that's usually when somebody is a small seller not like a you know a, whatever a big seller they will use ups because that's they work there and not at ups but they at their work that's who ships the you know what i'm saying i can't get through my call my son tuts i plug in my phone let me see how much 90 percent. that's good all right, I'm going to go, and I will try and do a light box video, because that's what I'm going to try and do. And yeah, I just don't have my bobby pins on. I just, I like, I tried to escape Chochi. He was kind of out and about, and I'm just like, bro, I got to go. He's like, I don't know. I'm like, nope, I'm going. I'm just going. And go, I did. Okay, I think that's it. Thanks for tuning in. And if you're wondering, there's nothing to wonder. No wonder, wonder no more, TFU.